Figure it out. Hello, my name is Dr. Paul Chano, and this, my friends, is Bad Movie Theater Quickie. Throughout film history, there have been many wonderful movies I've enjoyed, either on their own merits as a film, or simply because they are a guilty pleasure. However, a large number of them have one or two vital issues I sometimes find it hard to look past, so I will take it upon myself to show us some of the biggest issues in our favorite films. Enjoy. The Matrix. Why am I here? Ergo, concordantly, vis-a-vis, -vis, you know what? I have no idea what the hell I'm saying. Released in 1999 and made by the Wachowski Brothers. How'd you do, I? This film has several small issues that for the most part aren't worth going into, but there is one rather massive omission of logic in an otherwise great story. We learn in this film that the machines eventually took over mankind and now place humans in the Matrix and raise them as essentially a fuel source. We learned later in the sequels that the machines were also aware of the emergence of one anomaly would occur within a certain time frame because there will always be at least one human being that can't accept the Matrix program, and thus resulting in the systemic anomaly, or essentially Neo. I know Kung Fu. So the issue I have is, why didn't they just go with pigs or cows as a fuel source instead of humans? You know, a species that wouldn't resist? You see, what you haven't answered my question. I'm feeling a little vulnerable right now, so you just need to chill out. Hmm? Can you do that? Think about it. This is where pigs and cows live. Here is what the matrix of that would have to look and function like. Pretty simple. Duh, obviously. Now, to be fair, I should stick within the confines of the information we are provided with in the first film. But even so, that's where we learn that machines use humans as fuel and that mankind has a city they treat as a military base to carry out attacks on the machines from. Would it honestly have made more sense for them to go with a species that apparently had a terrorist cell by -like headquarters at the Earth's core, or a harmless species that wouldn't fight back at all? Either the machines have a penchant for complex irony, which means they're hardly a logical form of intelligence, or perhaps they were simply afraid of Neopig. Thus concludes today's episode of Bad Movie Theatre. Join us again next time. Thank you.